Police tell us a delivery driver found the teenagers behind a Roswell public store, and they say it was a double murder. Channel 2's Tom Jones is live in Roswell. Tom, in the last 30 minutes, you've now learned the identities of these victims. We did, Javita. One goes to Roswell High, the other goes to River Ridge High. Uh, we've seen parents and students continually drive by here, some students weeping as they came by. Uh, the murders, the bodies were found back here behind this Publix. One parent told me this is not something that they expect here. Just thinking of the families and the parents and our community. We're a tight knit community. A tight knit community that is shocked after learning someone murdered two teenagers behind the neighborhood Publix grocery store. It's not the kind of news they expect here. Oh, absolutely not. Never. Mm -mm. We shop right here and we live right there. It was just before 6 Monday morning. A delivery driver pulled up behind the Publix at Woodstock Road and King Road and discovered two bodies. The victims appear to be two teenagers from the area, um, both victims of some sort of head trauma. Roswell police have identified the victims as 17 year old Natalie Henderson and 17 year old Carter J. Davis. Natalie attended Roswell High, Carter went to River Ridge High. Police believe the teens arrived at the location between 2 and 3 early Monday morning. Investigators right now are following up on leads, uh, surveillance footage, any witnesses in the area. How to come in at 6? I'd have been right in the middle of it. Lisa Hawkins works at a shop in the plaza where the bodies were found. It's just too close to home. She says usually only delivery drivers come to the back of the plaza. She'll be extra careful from now on. I'm going to be very cautious when I get out every morning when it's dark. And we saw police tow away a garbage bin and two cars. Officers say those two cars are associated with the victims. Now, administrators have been working all day to get grief counselors on the two campuses to assist students. We're live in Roswell in North Fulton County. Tom Jones, Channel 2 Action News. And in just the last five minutes, we confirmed through a family member that this is a picture of one of the victims posted to her Facebook. She is 17-year-old Natalie Henderson will be gathering more information about both of the victims during this newscast.